Welcome to SVM's Playoff Blitz. I'm sports editor Dan Wasner, and in this edition, we will be talking about the Class 3A playoff game between the Oregon Hawks and the Wilmington Wildcats. The Oregon Hawks come in at 5 and 4. The Wildcats are 8 and 1. This is the second time these two schools have met in the playoffs. The last time was in 2008 when the Hawks beat Wilmington 21-14 in the 3A quarterfinals. The Hawks went on to the semifinals that year and lost a heartbreaker. Oregon is coming out of a very tough Big Northern West Conference this year. They uh, qualified for the playoffs for the 13th time. And while the Hawks had a fine season, they went 1-4 against teams with winning records with the lone win coming over 6-3 moments in week one. Oregon's offense has improved as the season's gone on. Uh, Nick Newman is their feature back. He has 908 rushing yards and seven TDs, but he's certainly not the only horse in the backfield. Uh, Sawyer Reynolds has 398 yards and seven TDs. Garrett Root has 383 yards. The Ashton, Rutherf Ashton Rutherford has 301 yards. They like to run the ball, which is going to match up just with the strength of Wilmington, who likes to do the same. This is going to be a physical, low-scoring game. The Wildcats were the champions of the Interstate 8 Conference, the small side of that conference. Their uh, toughest in-conference in competition came from Seneca, whom they beat, I think, 14-7. Seneca went 7-2. Their one loss was a 43-22 loss to Plano in Week 8. And some locals will remember that Wilmington played Newman last year in the 3A quarterfinals. The Comets won that game 28-26. There was a late game uh, two-point conversion try that I think a lot of people will remember. Um, like Oregon, like I said, Wilmington is a ground and pound team. They're going to get the job done on the ground. You know, they pass for about 300 yards, pretty much the same as Oregon. They are led by junior back Nick McWilliams, who rushed for 926 yards and 13 TDs. The Wildcats have three other backs that have over 250 yards rushing. And if you notice a trend, these teams are a lot alike. It just depends which one is better. I think it'll be physical. I think it'll be low scoring. I think Wilmington wins 14 to 10.